how to connect PHP with actual servers with uh, actual server in web server now just open web server right click on web server and right click on uh, as administrator yes just wait it green color yeah already now just go to check php version click on web server logo and php php version yeah my php version is 5.6.15 the release version of web server and php yeah i use uh, web server 3 and now just go before you connect actual server with php you must download microsoft actual server with php driver just go to its website microsoft.com and you can see this link and just scroll down and find microsoft driver for php for actual server now already i choose download yeah and my release version for PHP driver of my actual, uh, Microsoft Actual Server, I choose actual SRV32.ae. Click on it and I just download it. Okay, just save yeah, already you can click go to sorry go to open the folder and just right click on actual rv32 and run as administrator yes and next uh, yes and this step is for important for connect uh, Microsoft driver for PHP you can browse on your PHP folder on RAM yeah click on RAM bin PHP PHP 6.5.6.15 and for the E80 and click OK. Yeah, OK. Yeah, click yes yeah, to all because I have already before I override on it. OK, now just go to open uh, PHP folder on web server. Yeah bin php php 5.6.15 and for the e80 and just find php yeah php actual i or v underscore 56 because i use a php version is php 5.6 yeah this one 5.6.15 okay okay now I copy this name yeah to file this name just copy this file and go to web server and php and php dot i and i yes click on it and just find php underscore actual and follow i put this step yeah this pass and i pass it you can copy this extension yeah write this now 
I copy one more and pass and go to copy the name of PHP and it's called actual as always and it's called NTS yeah and pass it already pass it on php.ini now I just sales yeah sell close it and restart web server just click on web server and restart all service okay just wait it's green color okay already now I close this folder and just go to web server and folder www directory and you can create file uh, one folder for store the file connect to actual server with php I create already this config and now I have already index.php now just edit it yeah this one this is my server name my server name and my database name and username and password and connect and conditional if connection for connect or connect files okay now I go to open uh, local host click on local host and local host and folder config okay, folder config and enter just so it is connecting oh connect file because maybe I'm not run actual configuration now I click go to configuration yeah actual server 2016 configuration manager run it oh yeah sure not yet run actual server now right click on it and drop stop just wait yeah already it's running now just go to reload this page again yeah connect it that means uh, for this one okay now I go to actual server and so my server name and database user this is connected mistake this now just go to actual server Yeah, this is my server name. Yeah, server name. Server name. And this is my username. Yeah, user ID. Login. Sa. Yeah, Sa. And the password is 123. Connect. My database VBA DB My database VD VBA DB Yeah It is connected Connected Thank you for watching It's my tutorial about Connect actual server with PHP yeah, I think I This video can help you some Goodbye